Okay, so we are at the Double Tree uh, by Colton and Sweets in downtown Pittsburgh, and we'll be doing the room tour. Eight twenty-three. So, first starting off in the security department, we have the um, latch right here. Have the deadbolt, like that. Readable fire map, and a peephole. So, just like that, we are well taken in the security department. So, uh, looks like we have a um, closet right over here. A luggage rack uh, right here. Plenty of hangers, um, ironer, and an ironing board. So. Closet's well taken care of, and there's also a safe too, which is pretty convenient. So, closet's taken care of. Uh, let's take a look um, in this part of the room, shall we? Um, uh, looking at the um, uh, carpet, um, it looks to be in pretty good condition. Um, the beds look presentable at first, uh, and um, I took a, um, a look at some of the sheets uh, here and there, and uh, I don't know if you can see on camera, but um, uh, these things have, um, uh, so like uh, have been left um, on the um, sheets for quite some time. Uh, Let's see what the pillows uh, look like. Uh, they're pr in pretty decent uh, condition, uh, as far as I can tell. Uh, Alright, so that looks like a top sheet. Uh, down comforter here. Trying to peek through the sheets just to see if there's any problems I'm noticing. I don't think I'm noticing any so far. Uh, bottom sheet looks like it's in good condition as well. What about these pillows? I'd say they are pretty even, although one may be better than the others, uh, slightly. Uh, let's see, the mattress cover. Looks like it's in uh, a good condition. What about the mattress? Not noticing anything major with the mattress, and I say that. There's a stain right over here. It's probably a minor stain that happened uh, a couple years ago. Uh, see here. Oh, and there's a thing right here. Although, this may have been the actual mattress cover itself. Uh, what about the actual mattress? Not sure how old this mattress is. May have been around for quite some time. But I know it's, um, well taken care of, so go figure, I suppose. Uh, right over here, nightstand, uh, plenty of space, got your telephone, wall outlets, um, or excuse me, portable outlets, uh, which I really need to charge my phone after a long drive. Uh, got your clock right over there, uh, TV remote with plenty of Kleenex. Got a Samsung flat screen TV, uh, which looks to be in pretty decent uh, condition. The drawers are in um, good condition as well. Uh, the microwave, uh, which despite being the fact that it's apparently not plugged into the wall outlet, uh, actually looks relatively clean. 
Uh, let's see, you got a mini fridge down below. With an actual uh, display. Looks to be like a um, uh, pretty well sizable mini fridge. Also on an odd layout too. Uh, the chair right here, it looks um, decent. I mean, there may be a few uh, mystery stains here and there, but I'm pretty sure they've happened a few years ago. And this lamp right here, you basically have to reach uh, over way behind the chair if you want to turn it on. <laughs> I'm guessing the um, staff decided to put the lamp there just to not uh, have any of the um, uh, walking space um, blocked by um, any sort of like furniture. Uh, let's see, um, got the PTAC unit um, uh, right below the window, which is controlled by the um, uh, thermostat on the wall. Um, uh, let's see, the drapes. Um, They look like they're in um, pretty good condition. And let's see, the um, view outside. Um, if I can um, help get this uh, drape it open, but I think I'll just pull it up like that. But right over there, I don't know if you can see, but that is PBG Paints Arena. Set this thing down. Uh, workstation back over here. Get some lights on. It looks like it's in uh, uh, pretty good condition. I'm not noticing any sort of stains. Um, well, I don't know about that. Oh, that's not a stain. That's just um, something in which I don't know if. Housekeeping Mr. What, uh, but other than that, um, I don't think I'm missing any sort of uh, mystery stains uh, of some kind. Uh, the um, uh, light for above the uh, workstation uh, is um, okay. Uh, I don't know if you can see on camera, but there may be. Uh, few dead bugs um, uh, in the lamp and I don't know uh, uh, what um, was the original outcome from that hole in the ceiling. I don't know if there was an old uh, uh, light above the uh, workstation in which um, maybe the hotel staff probably decided to put a new light up there and not uh, worry about that. Um, Hole, probably where the original light was, but who knows? Now, I guess we'll um, go check out the bathroom. Um, uh, but first, um, have this um, area out here with the coffee maker and um, other sort of cups and complimentary supplies. Uh, the small towels look like they're in um, good condition. No red flags um, to point out. Um, got another light right above uh, the uh, mirror, like so. Another mirror right over here. Now we're going to so Check out the um, actual bathroom itself. Um, uh, the toilet looks like it's in pretty good condition. Uh, let's see, plumbing fixtures. The one for the sink seems to work well. The light's in decent condition. And so is the um, rack above the toilet. So. Uh, let's see what the actual uh, shower is. Um, 
And before I do that, not sure how this hair got on the um, actual door itself. Um, and I'm not sure how housekeeping missed that one either. Uh, looking at the actual shower itself, I guess I'd, I'd save the uh, big highlight for last. Um, I don't know how those stains uh, got up on the um, actual ceiling part of the actual shower. Maybe because of calcium buildup or something like that. Uh, the shower rack, um, despite uh, being in uh, decent condition, is actually quite sturdy. Let's see, shower curtain. Um, maybe a stain right there, but probably happened. A couple years ago, uh, the actual tub. Oh, found a hair. <laughs> oh, that's just great. Oh, and another hair. I don't know if you can see on camera. Uh, let's see. What about the actual um, uh, shower itself? Uh, let's see what we've got here. Uh, uh, I don't know if I have to. Pull out a warrant. Hang on. Does the shower not work? Not doing this right or what, but apparently I can't officially I cannot even get the damn shower to turn on. Alright, not gonna fight it. I may be a coward, but I am I don't want to break it. But I don't know, maybe I'm not trying um, just to turn the water on, but who knows. Well, I guess we decided to save um, the um, big highlight for last. Uh, for some reason, I could not get the um, shower to uh, turn on. I cannot figure out how to get the water flowing. I tried every bit of my muscle just to try to uh, Turn the handle, and for whatever reason, the shower would not come on whatsoever. Um, but despite uh, the uh, uh, big problems with um, not getting shower water, um, this whole room doesn't seem um, uh, too bad. Um, I mean, I did notice a few mystery stains here and there, but... If you can uh, get a room with um, an actual working shower, then uh, good for you. But on that note, that is going to be it for me. Thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.